That was a very cool experience. Very fun. It was. Hey guys, it's Mark and Laurie with Gables on the Go. Hey everybody. Hey, today we've got a neat show for you. We are uh, at Duck Key, which is uh, just outside of Marathon before you get to Marathon going down to the, in, in the Florida Keys. And uh, they are having a big boat show here all over the island. We're going to walk around, show you all the boats and the sights. It is, what is today? January the 24th. 24th. January yes, the 24th, 24th, guys. It's about... Mm -hmm. 74 75 degrees sunny beautiful and yes. uh, we're hoping we can bring you some some warmth and sunshine through the video if you're up north in the snow and the cold so yeah. come along with us let's mm -hmm. go take a look at the duck key boat show all right let's go see it we're here at hawks k resort and this is the island boat show 2021 this is the uh the largest boat show in the keys and this is a, a great cause. All proceeds go to benefiting high school uh, scholarships to get to college for Marathon and Coral Shores High School. The rest of the funds go to support missions and ministries of Island Community Church. So it's a wonderful cause. We've probably got 75 boats here in water and both out water on trailers. So if you're looking to buy a boat or some merchandise, there's some fabulous vendors here that are supporting our event. This is the place to be. It's a three-day event. We do this every year in January at Hawks K. So please uh, come on out. It's kind of getting late today, but next year we'll be doing it again. So thanks a lot for your uh, support and interest in the Island Boat Show. Guys, check this out. They're demonstrating the Sea Keeper. It's that thing in that glass underneath the guy standing in front of right there. It keeps the boat from rocking side to side. It's a gyro stabilizer. So when he flips it on, watch the boat just settle. Boom. Look at that. That is so cool. <laughs> that is so cool. So when you're offshore, that, that stabilizer just keeps you from rocking side to side constantly and stabilizes the boat. That is really awesome. The new CV. CVZ. Beautiful boat there. That's the Into the Blue uh, fishing show, if you've seen that on TV. It's the Grady White boats here. I'm going out to the end out here to what I'm seeing. This is their big dual console. Laurie and I had the 28 Cobia dual console, which is a the same layout as this big Grady, but this Grady's a lot bigger than what we had. What a beautiful boat. Wow, look at that layout. 44-foot 44, 44 contender, guys, if I can get it out. Look at those screens on that thing, <laughs> golly. Those are huge. 44 feet long, double row, under the hard top. Cabin was sleeping down there. Look at this front seating up front. That is awesome. Oh, there are boats as far as I can see up this dock up there. Look, <laughs> one after another. Every brand, Nautic Star, Everglades. This is a cool new boat we saw last year at the Miami Boat Show. Look at how they did the back of this one, the new Solus. Got this between the engines back here. Swim ladder, extendable, that retracts back in. This opens up a lot of space on the back of that boat. Boston Whaler Outrage right here. Look at the room inside that boat. Look at that. That's almost like a, like a mini sport fisherman. Flybridge with outboards. <clears throat> the size of that boat, golly. That is gorgeous. See the front of this thing. I think it's got an open bow up front. Obviously, it's got a... <clears throat> okay, it's got a cabin underneath, and it's got seating up front. All right, we're going to go check out this new World Cat, because um, we really like cats now that we have one. 
And this looks like um, future dreams and goals, maybe? Absolutely. <laughs> My name is Todd Eberlein with Unique Marine, and we're on the 40 dual console from WorldCat. This is our second year in production of this boat. She's 12.8 wide, length of 40 feet, weighs without engines about 15,000 pounds, and I'm going to walk you through a few of the features of this boat. Okay. One of the first things you're going to notice is our walk-through transom with our catamarans, which basically extends the boat a couple extra feet. People buy this boat all the time just for this ladder. This is a custom dive ladder that looks like it's off a commercial dive boat, but it comes standard with pretty much all World Cat boats. In the transom, we have a summer kitchen this year where it should be instead of in the cockpit. Yeah. So if you burn something, you can just throw your burnt food and throw it right over. Great so, idea. Here's our grill setup, paper towel holder, sink, refrigerator. Just makes it very convenient and out of the way of the rest of the passengers on the boat. That's great. I like that. For the fishermen, we have a live well, and then we have a freezer plate to keep all your drinks in here. So you just put your drinks in there in the morning, turn the freezer plate on, and everything will chill and be nice and cold all day long. Nice. One of the biggest features of catamarans is they're wide. They have a lot of cockpit space and a lot of room for activities. Mm -hmm. Basically, you can put paddle boards in here, you can put tubes in here, you can put a ton of stuff and still have the whole rest of the boat that's usable. That's right. Something nice about this boat here is our back, this backrest that slides, so if you are fishing, you can sit and sit back here. Sit yeah. under the shade. And you can like sit under that, the shade, but don't forget the short shade up top, so oh, that yeah. comes in and out. Okay. And if you're just cruising along, going to the Bahamas, clearly you're gonna want more seating. And then you have an L seat lounge up forward here that gives you a lot, of, a lot of extra room. This boat has a generator, air conditioning, air conditioning at that helm. It has a, a lot of features. If you come up to the helm, check this out. Our helm is an electric, nice. sitting on an electric slide, so it moves forward and back. So for the uh, height challenge, you can just sit down. And one of the one of our notable features of the WorldCat is a single deck dual console boat, meaning you don't have to step up. And a lot of boats have to put a step in their boat in, in the cockpit in order to see over the, over the helm. If you look, so you can see clearly over this helm, you've got a great visibility all the way through, whether you're driving and or sitting. I actually drove this boat here about an hour drive and I sat down the whole time and I can see over it just fine. Yeah, I like that. One of the cooler features is our electric moon roof that also has a shade. Right today is a pretty nice day out, but full summer, you're gonna have a lot of sun, you're gonna need uh, to close that, and you still get, the, it allows the air to still come in. Yeah. You can actually leave this open while you're running, and it's fantastic, uh, you know, fantastic right now in the winter time yeah. to have. Oh, look, the table. Oh, wow. Lifting up. Lifting up. So, one of the cooler features is our bow table setup that actually, Rick, deploys all the way flush with the hull and then you can get an idea you can see how it'll look once it's yeah, flush it's down. so it goes down oh yeah, yeah all awesome. the way so it's we have a, a, a one-piece windshield that just closes instead of having the the traditional centerpiece that opens yeah. that you cannot close so you'll see that this is one piece less framing and when it's when it's closed you can basically can't even hear you can barely hear anything yeah. so we actually have a door and we can enclose this whole boat if it's raining in the summer in raining in the summertime or the winter, it can be fully protected. Very nice. One thing about all catamarans is that we have a lot of room in our sponsors, not in the center line. So we're able to do a lot more things. And if we have a full stand-up shower inside this sponson. Oh wow. And I'm six I'm six two and I can stand up almost inside here. Yeah. Very cool. Beautiful. I love the fishbowl scene. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it, it's it's still a day boat, but it gives you a lot. It gives you a pretty good sized day bed. If you got it overnight for a couple of days, you'd be all right in something like this. Yeah. We have a side dive door, so most people. This is great for getting on and off the dock. For divers, they seem, seem to always love this aft platform yeah. more than anything. But this dive platform, depending on where your dock is, is uh, really util util utilitarian. It is nice, nice. 
Uh, for the fisherman at hand, we have a sea chest, which basically runs our uh, our generator and all any through haul fittings. So you're always going to have prime with this particular vessel. Mm, that's nice. Let's see if it that's a pretty cool feature, actually. Yes. That's the refrigerator. Refrigerator. Yeah, frizz. It's got two refrigerators. I like that. Yeah, I do too. Who wouldn't? One of the unique features about this 40DC is that this World Cat, when you turn, it basically turns flat. It is a, a performer, it is fuel efficient, it, it only has twin engines on this boat, but it is a catamaran and you do not have to have four engines on a, a 40 foot boat if it's a catamaran. You're more than welcome to put that on there, we'll do it, but it's just not needed. Uh, welcome you to come up to Unique Marine and take a ride anytime. All right, thanks Tom. I think she's buying. Are you actually guys blowing Yeah, this is the back one. I love this one. My favorite one. Hello. Hey. You can fit it into the seat. Wonder Packs. Wonder Packs, okay. They have a little button inside. I love it. That is somewhere. Where is it? Oh, here. But it's, oh, okay. So you go ahead and you click the button, and it instantly gets hot. 130 yeah. degrees. Oh, wow. Yeah. And you can also make them cold. How long does it stay hot like that? It stays hot for an hour, and it stays cold for an hour. Okay. And then we have the big one here, the neck and shoulder one. It helps with any, like, aches and pains, inflammation, anything you might be feeling. It's really nice. I was putting it on her. Good. Would you like to feel it, sir? That's cool. Yeah, the cold? Yeah, the cold. Of yeah, course. yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, oh. <laughs> and I'm hot too. He likes it. <laughs> he hey babe, hold the camera, put it on a tripod. We're gonna stay here a while. <laughs> oh, I love it. All right, well, by the I like hour, it. sir, okay? <laughs> yeah. 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 Yeah, so Laurie's back there using the credit card. She bought it. <laughs> she wanted the heat packs. Her back bothers her all the time, so she had to have the had to have the heat pack thing. It is pretty cool. You just press that button in the pack and bang, it gets hot instantly and stays hot for an hour. Pretty cool deal. Well guys, I can't come to the boat show without doing a little real estate since I am a real estate agent. Look at these cute little places right here. So the, the docks are right there. You can see the boats on it. And, uh, but they got these, these uh, cute little cottages, condos on the water out here in Hawks Cay Marina. If you want any information on these places, if you'd like to live somewhere like this, I can help you with that. All my information is in the description, uh, the video description below, and I'll get you all the info on uh, the price of these places and all uh, how Hawks Cay Resort works and all that kind of stuff. So give me a call. Hey guys, we're, uh, we're on the new uh, 264 Hybrid Cat. And Jovan here is going to take us out on this boat. Uh, I, I hear it's pretty quick. It's a, it's a little quick. Pretty quick boat. Hey, we're going to take you for a ride. Come go with us. Hi, I'm Jovan, and I'm going to show you guys the 26-foot hybrid cat. Uh, we're going to take you for a sea trial and show you why it's the best boat for down here in the Keys. It floats in 14 inches of water. It's fast. It's fuel efficient. It's got a 10-foot beam, and it's perfect for the family down here. So we'll show you a little ride. All right. Looking forward to it. You ready, baby? Ready. <laughs> Better hold on to anything that's going to blow away. I don't have
<laughs> 25 miles an hour and that was our turn radius you guys can see out there in the water that's crazy boat handles like a slot car <laughs> awesome who actually designed this boat was it chase that we made it uh, not no, chase uh, sean, sean that we sean monahan he be came up with the concept of having a hybrid cat that did everything that he wanted in a boat yeah. so he put the, the the project together and uh, built an incredible product i mean yeah. i think we hit the nail on the head when it comes to having a boat that does it all yeah all right lorraine gracie are going up top <laughs> Don't film my butt. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> so, okay. Just step here, here, there. and okay. 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 I feel like I should be barefoot. I'm the captain now. Alright, let me get a shot from the oh. front of them. Oh, I'll go, I'll go slow. Oh, okay. I don't know if I like it. <laughs> I know, that's what I like. I'm not so sure about this. <laughs> wow. This is, oh, it is beautiful though. It is beautiful. This is crazy. That little girl on the boat before us was up here. So I mean, that's true. Can't so you, you guys can do it. Woo. You can do it. <laughs> yeah. Having a boat that does it all, I could get out and go sword fishing with the family 20 miles offshore. 2,000 feet of water and then come into the sandbar and pull right into the sandbar into knee deep water and kids can play. Yeah. Go to dinner. Um, exactly. It's, and then if I wanted to fish the backcountry another day, I still, I just have one boat rather than having a big boat and another bay boat. Absolutely. This boat does do it all. That was a very cool experience. It was very fun. It was. Yeah. We felt like we were on top of the world. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna go eat at Angler and Ale, which is right here dockside behind the boat show, and I hear they have some fantastic food. I'll Super cool place. Get you guys some good shots of that. Come on, let's yeah. go see. Yeah, let's go check it out. Guess you guys can see this view behind me back here. Not bad at all, not bad at all. This Angler and Ale restaurant is extremely nice. We haven't had the food yet. Service has been good so far. Got us a couple drinks, but what a picturesque place to uh, sit here by the marina and look over the beautiful Florida Keys out here. If you guys are down here in Duck Key, I'd probably stop by here. Jumbo lump crab cakes. Oh, no, salt and vinegar crab cakes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> salt and vinegar crab cakes. And a lettuce wedge. What kind of lettuce wedge? A key, key wedge salad. Key wedge That's salad. That's what it's called. It's beautifully stacked. Yeah. <laughs> and fried pickles. They're probably hot, but I'm gonna try one with the ranch. Pickles. So we hope you enjoyed the boat show with us and Angler and Ale going to eat lunch, a late lunch. It was yep. delicious crab cakes. Mmm, perfect. So we will see you next time on Gables on the Go. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you guys. Thanks Bye. for watching. <laughs>